Xeoma is a professional yet simple to use video surveillance program that allows you to take your surveillance cameras to the next level at an affordable price. Xeoma is compatible with most IP and USB cameras. It'll even work with analog cameras, provided you have a capture card. It is compatible with all major platforms, Windows, Linux, Mac, as well as iOS and Android. You can even use Xeoma as a client on another machine to review your camera without purchasing additional licenses. I'm using Xeoma Pro with a top-of-the-line IP camera from Trend DNet, the TV IP 430Pi. It's a PTZ dome camera. After configuring my Xeoma with my Trend Dent camera, which is automatically detected, I have a shortcut of my camera's stream presented. If I had additional cameras configured, those would be shown. I'll briefly walk through the different features and settings. At the main menu, let's take a look at remote access. Connect to allows me to connect to my Xeoma server from a different computer. For instance, my Xeoma is running as a server on my Mac Mini, and I'm currently accessing it from my Mac Pro as a client. If I had multiple homes or businesses on a Xeoma server, I can use multi-server mode to view them on a single interface. Repeater allows Xeoma server to be accessed wherever there is internet. Xeoma offers the ability to create additional users and features can be restricted to certain users. Back onto the main menu, all cameras can be turned off or on. Groups can be made with multiple cameras. Installation and registration are used to activate and configure where Xeoma stores its system files. I can simply click on the shortcut to view my camera's stream in full quality and additional options are presented. The menu option allows me to create groups and enable zoom mode. Additional cameras can be added by selecting the plus button. The settings button is the main configuration area for the camera. Xeoma uses modules to represent features and devices. I'll demonstrate the main modules included. The module Universal Camera is the connected camera and all the other modules following it on the chain controls feature. It is similar to an IFTTT setup. I have a motion detector module placed after the camera module. I have advanced settings and so far Xeoma has done a great job recognizing motion and preventing false alerts. I have a PTZ tracking module connected to the motion module, so PTZ only occurs when motion is present. PTZ tracking on compatible cameras allows the camera to follow moving objects automatically. The preview and archive module is attached directly to the camera module, so the camera is always recording. I can modify various recording settings such as video quality and the storage size on the archive. If I place a motion module before the preview and archive module, my camera will only record when motion is present. Modules can easily be added or deleted. Likewise, with the schedule module, I can create a recording schedule. The problem detector module does exactly what it says. It'll send a notification when a problem occurs, such as if a camera goes offline. There are many other useful modules such as email and SMS notifications. The web server module creates a web page so I have the ability to view my camera from another web browser. It does not have the same features as the Xeoma client, but it is still useful for when I need to access my camera from another computer that doesn't have the Xeoma client installed. I can view the camera stream, access archives, and have ability to control the PTZ. I really like how Xeoma built the module chain. It allows professional features to be pretty simple to set up. Archives can be viewed by selecting the play button. Playback speed can be adjusted as well. It is fast and simple to use, however I would like to have the ability to view previews as I cursor over the timeline. Video clips can be exported as well. I would also like to see the ability to create PTZ presets as I find Xeoma to struggle with tracking objects. As you can see from the sample clip I exported, the PTZ tracking does not really follow the car. If PTZ presets can be added, the camera can turn to a specific place where motion is detected in a specific area. Xeoma also has an app available for iOS and Android that connects to the Xeoma server. The camera stream and archive can be viewed from here. The app can use some user interface improvements and the ability to adjust settings. I hope they implement the ability to view previews when motion is presented, similar to what Dropcam offers with their app. Overall, Xeoma is the best video surveillance program that I have seen and I would highly recommend trying it out.
I'll leave the links in the description down below with some more information. Please subscribe if you enjoyed this video, and I plan on uploading subsequent videos with updates soon.